My name is uh, Peter Verhagen. I have been teaching yoga as an independent professional yoga teacher since 2013. I teach in my yoga studio at home and also in yoga centers, companies and cultural institutions. My yoga training was very diverse. From the beginning, I chose not to limit myself to one particular direction, school or current of yoga. I work from those different visions and schools towards the essence. And the result is a rational, contemporary approach to yoga. A yoga that works for active people in the 21st century, in which I resolutely avoid all references and terminology or jargon that is too culturally determined. I was uh, introduced to yoga myself about 20 years ago when a yoga teacher at the company where I worked at the time came to teach one hour every week on Thursday at lunchtime. And I was pleasantly surprised to notice how much more energy and peace I experienced in the afternoons after her classes. It was like the difference between day and night. From my own experience of about 10 years, I have learned that employees in offices mainly suffer from mental and emotional stress related to either difficult interactions or conflicts with other people, or because they work on screens, or because, let's face it, they experience an inner conflict with some aspect of their, their jobs. Moreover, they are suffering from physical stress related to sitting still at their desks for long periods of time. The exercises and postures I offer in the yoga series allow for restoration of balance. By consciously restoring contact with the physical body, we can release some of that mental pressure. And the exercises are mainly dynamic and agile so that the body can be released from what I would call this sort of cramp of, uh, of sitting still. In the yoga classes for companies, I do my best to create a nice arc between effort and relaxation. The yoga series starts with a few warm-up exercises, followed by some more intense dynamic exercises, as well as quiet static moments. The yoga postures address the four basic functions of the spine. Forward bend, back bend, twist and lateral extension. Inverted postures in which the head is turned downwards are also addressed. And the combination of all these functions in a well-chosen order ensures a smoother and more intense flow of vital energy. This has a lasting effect for days and in the long run people feel more flexible, stronger and calmer, both mentally and physically. And that benefits, of course, their well-being and productivity. A class ends with an average of five to seven minutes of deep relaxation. I start from three essential pillars for an efficient yoga practice. Mental presence by focused attention, conscious deep breathing and movement or posture according to one's own individual breathing. And the latter means, for example, that the participants move at their own pace. And that is a radical difference with most group classes where the rhythm is imposed. The classes are accessible to everyone. My personal investment during the class is to make sure that it appeals to everyone at their level. This means that for people with a little less ability, simpler versions of postures are suggested and people who naturally crave more intensity can try more challenging versions of the same postures. In short, Organizing yoga classes within the company is a simple and affordable way to considerably enrich the working experience of the staff. And if you feel 
that this is something for your business or your organization, then I invite you to explore the possibilities together. Thank you very much for your attention.